Hello, this is Mr. Wirtz, and today in this video, we are going to be looking at how to follow and continue the pattern. And the way to do that, just look about, look at the pattern, think about it, then continue the pattern. And when I say think about it, what you can do with think about it is guess and check. Just do guess and checking, and I can show you how to do guess and check. And you can review and see how to do this. So we are looking at a problem here. Here is a pattern of pictures in a book. On page one, there are five pictures. Page two, there are seven pictures. So what is the pattern that we see here? We see the pages go up plus one. So every page goes up plus one. And most people saw that right away, but they didn't realize that such an easy thing is actually a pattern. So the pages go up plus one. But how about down here? How do you get from five pictures on a page to seven pictures on a page? Well, five plus one is six, plus one more is seven. Oh, wow. Well, that pattern is plus two. So now I know how to fill in the rest. Seven plus two is going to be nine. Nine plus two is going to be 11. 11 plus 2 is going to be 13. Oh, some of you may realize what's going on here. Some of you may realize that all of these numbers are all of these numbers even or odd. Think about that for a moment because you can use that for help down below. Fill in the rest of these numbers. And then you can do the work down below. Let's take a look at the work down below. Describe two or more patterns that you see up above. Oh, we just did that. The pages go up by one, and the pictures go up by two. Another way to say that is count by two, count by one. So there you go for that one. How many pictures will be on page 23? Well, let's look at page 20. Oh, it only goes up to page 10. Okay. So we need to figure out what to do here. I know we can get as high as page 10 on this one. So the number you put here, ooh, gets you up to page 10. But we want to get to page 23. Hmm. So we, we will know what page 10 will be. But how do we find out? How do we find out what will be on page 23? Oh, this is cool. We can follow the pattern all the way up to 20 and then all the way up to 23. Just keep counting. There's another way to do it though. When you get up to the number 10 page, this number you have here for the number of pictures, you can multiply it. 10 times 2 equals 20. So we can just multiply this number that we find out about page 10. We just multiply it times 2, and we will find out the number of pictures on page 20. And then we can just count by two more, two more, two more, three times. 20 plus three, well, 20 plus two plus two plus two. We're gonna get a final answer here. If we add this number, plus two, plus two, plus two, we'll get our final answer here. Pretty cool, because we're counting by twos three times. Or you can just count by twos 23 times. Two, seven, nine, 11, 13, Keep counting by twos until you get to 23. That's one way to do it.
All right. But whatever way you do, you do need to show your work down below here. Show your work. You can do a bunch of plus twos, plus twos, plus twos. Or you can do it my quick strategy. Since 10 times 2 is 20, you do that number times 2 to get this. And then you add three more twos to get your final answer. You can pause this video and look at this picture. Show your work down below here. You can ask me for some more help on this or anything else. And that is what you can do to follow and continue patterns. Make guesses and check your work. Realize that it's count by ones, count by twos. And you can keep going from there. Let me know if you'd like some more help with that. Until then, good luck.